Good morning, everyone. Steve Georgie here from Allendale's Trading Floor. It is October 26th, so getting close to the end of the month. Uh, we have got corn down a half a cent overnight, beans down about four and a quarter, wheat up five and three quarter cents, uh, but harvest pressure continues. So we do have harvest progress that will be out later on this afternoon, uh, expecting to be right around 85% complete for beans and about 75% complete for corn. Uh, there is very limited news out there as far as the grains. Um, not a lot uh, should be affected from, from this storm Patricia that had moved uh, very quickly uh, into that Texas area and, and now through the Southern Plains, but um, there shouldn't be that, many, that much backlash as far as the grain markets uh, in that regard. Um, but other than that, very, very limited news right now. Still probably going to see some pressure here from harvest. Uh, we need to keep watching developmental stories here and, and what could happen uh, out of South America uh, as far as their, uh, their weather. Uh, will, it, will they get too much rain to little rain to what? We need to find something to propel these markets higher uh, at some point. CFTC report out on Friday um, showing the fund positions. Uh, big sellers of, of grain last week uh, big sellers for corn. Uh, the funds ended up selling 59391 uh, That puts them with a, still a long position for corn, but at 32833 So pretty much flat. There's, not a, there's nothing out there really to push them in either direction. Now for beans, though, on the other hand, there were sellers of 35,740 contracts. Uh, that puts them net short. 52,266. So they are net short. They are getting a bigger position there as far as these beans. Uh, and we'll see how we react right around this $9 area. Um, interesting development for cattle. Uh, World Health Organization released a study or will be releasing a study that they had done here today at some point. Um, there was news leaked out on Friday. We'll see if it's correct or not, but there was news uh, released on Friday uh, that processed meats and red meats are they are a cancer risk. Um, will we see an effect here this morning? How's the public going to take this once we see this? Um, but they haven't released the study here as of as of yet. So um, we'll see. As of right now, we're expecting cattle maybe mixed to a little bit lower. Box beef though coming in mixed, choice down 30. Select uh, down 103, um, but then hogs. Hogs took a sharp dive here on Friday, uh, broke through some, some good support levels right down to their next area. Uh, but we are in a seasonal, uh, a seasonal time where we have to watch these hogs. Typically we do break this time of year and, and they may have just started uh, some of their descent. But cutout values dropping uh, 209. And so expecting them to start off maybe mixed a little bit lower this morning as well. Stock market up just 14 points right now. Uh, the dollar down 14 cents at this time with crude oil down about 30. So give us a call if you have any questions. We're here to help you out. You can reach us at 800-262-7538. Hope you guys have a great day and we'll talk to you again tomorrow. Take care.